Hello and welcome. In this video, we will work and look how to make a bubble chart. In the bubble chart, the circle represents the dimensions and size represent the measures. Let's see it in practice. So we have a new worksheet where we have connected to our sample superstore file from the tablet itself. You can see it right here. We have the sample superstore file. Let's go back to the data and go to the worksheet. In order to create a bubble chart, let's say we want to know which state has the highest sales in the form of bubbles. So if we say, if we click on state here and bring it, let's say to columns. Let's say if you bring the sales to rows, it gives us a bar chart, but we don't want a bar chart, we want a bubble chart. So we need to have either one dimension and a measure which fulfills our criteria. So if we click on the show me button, it says that in order to have a bubble chart, we need to have one or more dimensions or measures. So we click on it and now we will have a bubble chart where the states will be our dimensions and the size will represent our sales. In order to make it more visually appealing, let's bring the state to colors and now as you can see the states the different sizes corresponding to different sales so as you can see we have california with highest number of sales in the form of bubbles then we have new york then we have texas followed by washington and so on so this is our bubble chart where the size represents the quantitative or a measure value while the circle represents the dimension value. Let's give this chart a name, bubble chart. Bold, orientation, click on apply. Similarly, let's rename the sheet here as bubble chart. 